Hi guys, Megan Duma here, your host at Wine for Blondes. And as you can see, we're standing on the hilltop that is Artessa Winery. Now, Artessa is a beautiful, beautiful winery, probably one of the most beautiful in the Napa Valley. It sits actually built into a hillside. And I'm here with Jennifer Head, who's the sales manager and wine club rep. And she's going to tell us a little bit about Artessa and a very cool new uh, promo that they're running on naming three new wines. Now, Jen, tell us about the, the three new wines that, that you guys are promoting. Yes, we're promoting uh, three new blends, a Rioja blend, which is a Spanish blend, and a Cab Franc and Merlot blend, and a Cabernet um, Bordeaux style blend. We're very fortunate to have Mark Berenger as our winemaker here, and as a master blender, we're going to take advantage of his skills and have him craft these three wonderful blends here at Artessa, um, and we're going to have two of those as club exclusive um, blends for our club members only, and that's going to be the Rioja blend and the Merlot Cab Franc blend. Um, so what we've started is is a net root and grass root naming contest um, so if you can submit uh, your names online through our Twitter account, Facebook account, um, or our blog um, are here at our Tessa Vineyards. Okay, cool. So we will hook up a link from our Facebook page, from Wine for Blondes Facebook page, and from Wine for Blondes uh, blog in order so you guys can go on and enter in your names. Now, be creative because Artessa is really is about combining art and wine together, a, the a theme that we see often in the wine industry. There's tons of great places to that combine art and wine. Now, tell us about your resident artist here at Artessa. Our resident artist is Gordon Huther. Um, he's a local artist here and does amazing sculptures um, and pieces, and we've got a lot of those here at the winery and the wonderful thing is we're very fortunate to have him be able to bring those that art here mm -hmm. and move and change it out so it's always new and it's always fresh uh, and he's got a wonderful studio here in Napa as well and he's doing pieces all over the United States and we feature those uh, quarterly in our club newsletter oh, very cool very cool so so you can see some of I think his art here as you look at the um, the pools behind us it's a really really gorgeous and these will be uh, you know rotated out now this one is kind of an interesting little guy here. What's the name of this art piece? Um, that is the tickler. Why is it called the tickler? <laughs> <laughs> okay, moving on. It's a, it's a very interesting um, cylinder shape and uh, he just seems like a very artistic type of guy and that's cool. That's, that's combining the art and wine. It's, it's both very sexy so we like it. Um, now, Jen, tell us about what we're drinking here. This is our 2006 Tempranillo, okay. and that is a Spanish varietal, and it is grown here on the property, and we also have um, some planted in our Alexander Valley um, property as well. Um, that's Ridgeline Vineyards. Um, Alexander Valley is in Sonoma County, as you know. Okay, so we're just over the hill there, isn't yes. it? Sonoma. Yes. Can you guys, can you get a shot of that hill, that big, that big freaking hill right there? If you go over that hill just a little ways, that's Sonoma, but we're still in Napa in the Carneros region. Now, um, truth be told, Artessa is actually one wine club that I'm a member of. So, uh, I'm not a member of that many, so it's kind of a, a, definitely a cheers and a cool thing. And I've had the Tempranillo many, many times. It's one of my favorites. And two of the three wines, that are, you guys are going to name are going to be wine club exclusive. So i uh, got to hook up with Jen's wine club and Artessa's wine club in order to get those. And that's the Cabernet Franc blend and the Rioja blend. So it's going to be your name and only shipped to the wine club members. So very cool. Yes, we're very excited about it. Well, Jen, thanks for talking with us. We You're really welcome. appreciate it. And Thank you. hopefully the Wine for Blonde viewers, at least one of them, will drive some, some great names to you and name your next wine. Oh, great. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you.